so hey guys welcome back once again and in today's video i'm gonna talk about how to run control net extension on google collab so most of them were asking me about this thing that how to run control net on google collab so yes i found out two of the links that you can go and run control net extension the first link is over here as you can see control net collab fp16 models with automatic 1111 gui this is the first link that i found and yes you can go and run on like with automatic 1111 gui so this is the first thing and the next link is this as you can see over here command duro control net collab so here you can see there are lots of models merge but this is not automatic 1111 but yes you can use lots of models on control net extension arcane diffusion as well and like anything v4 as well so there are lots and lots of model and yes i will show you how to run this file and let me tell you i was using this as you can see over here i was using on like automatic 1111 on google collab so let's get started and let me tell you how to run this file so, so guys first we will start with control net or automatic 1111 GUI and I will paste the link in the description so the first thing you need to do is click on this link and after clicking on to this link then this web page will open and after this if you wish to download then you can download it as well or you can directly click on Google Collaborate over here just click on Google Collaborate and this is the web page that it will open so the next thing that you need to do in order to run you can see over here it's already written how to run models so there are couple of the models just like stable diffusion realistic vision chill out mix model dream shaper model anything and couple of the models going on so these are only couple of the models on automatic 1111 Google Collab first of all let me tell you it's already written over here below are the model codes for our base model just pick one or two don't pick more than two okay so i will just go on to one i will show you how to run this so in order to select models it's already written you can see remove the hashtag from the beginning of curl and mv line so what you need to do is that you just need to remove this hashtag so let's go on to run like anything v3 so we will remove the hashtags over here just remove this hashtags and that's the only thing that you need to do so that it will now select anything v3 model so after this removing hashtag just come on to run time and just run all and after clicking on to run all just click on to run anyway one thing that let me tell you guys that it will take uh, some time so have patience as well so as i have said guys it will take couple of time so have patience and as you can see after loading you can see over here just come on like bottom of the page and you will see two links one is running on local url and second one is running on public url so just click on public url and you are good to go with like automatic 1111 you can see this is loading and yeah let it load first of all and let's see so as you can see this is loaded automatic 1111 web ui and let's go on to image to image and you can see over here anything v3 and yes we are on to like image to image and so let's go on to like something like this image i was just working on with like this image today yes control net extension so this is the extension loaded over here let's drop on to like so let's go on to one image any of the image and yes you can select over here that model or or any model you can see see there are so many models similarly to that we were using on like local automatic 1111 so let's select on canny and here also canny model okay and these are the setting first of all let's set 768 because the resolution of this image is 768 by 512 we will not mess on to this settings because i'm only showing you how to run this on google collab so in order to use like control net you need to enable it first of all low vram no okay because we are running on google collab so you don't need to click on low vram i guess so yes canny preprocessor canny model and let's see what result do we get first of all there is no prompt over here so what i will do is that i will go on to png info i will click on to drop on to image and let's find out this image and let's open this image and it will find the png info over here you can see this is the png info so i will copy this prompt let's copy this prompt and go on to image to image and just paste it over here that's the thing we are doing and then let's generate so this is the result that we got it's loading for now you can see okay so this is the result that we got and this is the canny edge image loaded over here so that's how you can use it on like google collab and yes definitely you can use it on google collab as well so as i said 
already there are only couple of the models as you can see there are couple of the models running on over here if you want to select like stable diffusion 1.5 then just delete this hashtags and run so that's how you can run on google collab first of all this was automatic 1111 so yes guys you can go and enjoy like control net extension on google collab with this link and now i will show on to like next link as well this link cam and do rule control net this is not automatic 1111 gui first of all let me tell you so before running this control net collab let me tell you one thing that first of all you need to like terminate this program this is already running on google collab like we were running this on google collab so just terminate this first of all so why you need to like disconnect is because it was already running previous model so first of all you need to disconnect from here and let's close this now so guys now in order to run this control net collab after like disconnecting previous model so in order to run this just click on there are so many models over here you can see there are so many models we will just run any of the model just click on to any of the model okay after clicking on to any of the model just click on to open in collab over here and it will open this on collab as well so after coming on to this folder you just need to go on to runtime and just run all and after clicking on to run all just click on to this run anyway so that's the only thing that you need to do with this link so now it's loading over here you can see it's loading so let it load have a patience and let it load so guys after clicking on to run it has loaded finally and yes it took me couple of time like around 5 to 6 minute it took me and yes in this as well you can see there are two url one is local url and one is public url so click on to like gradio.live so just click on to it and it will open this web page and you can see this is loaded over here and yes these are the models canny model half model i don't know which model is this because it's not yet on automatic 11 so hd model scribble scribble interactive fake scribble pose segmentation depth and normal map i don't know which is this model but yes there are so many models over here but only one thing that i found on this link is that you can't add like second image just as i did on like automatic 1111 you can only add one image over here so we will click on to any of the image just like this image let's go on to this image and it advanced option you can see over here image first of all so how much image do you want it will just generate how much image do you want and on second thing it is image resolution so it's 512 only and just this thing low threshold high threshold just like setting that i explained yesterday the video link will be already in the description you can check on this if you load any of the image over here it will automatically load the seed so what you need to do is just decrease the seed that it will go on to minus 1 and yes this google collab is using ddim samplers so this is the sampler that's only sampler that it is using in the bottom you can see added prompt and negative prompt as well so what we will do is just copy this prompt and let's paste it over here and what we will do cyberpunk style and that's the only thing that we will go and let's see what result do we get so we will not mess with any of the setting we will go with like any model and let's run and let's see what result do we get so guys this is a result that we got with like any model as you can see this is a result that we got let's click on to this you can see this is the full image of the canny edges and this is a result that we got pretty amazing result so that's it how you can use it pretty simple nothing much more and that's the only thing that you can go and use it let's go on to hd model and let's try to upload here as well okay let's try back this time and what we will do we will just try to add cyberpunk style this prompt only similar options over here images image resolution hd resolution steps and guidance scales we will not mess with and yes again you can see uh, seed is loaded automatically after you upload any of the image so what we will do we will just decrease this seed similar ddim sampler added prompt and yes that's all you can do and let's just run and let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see over here hd model and that's the result that we got this is the outline edges of the hd model and this is the result that we got pretty amazing result let's go on to if you want to save this image or look into like closer of this image then right click over here and open into new tab after clicking on to the new tab you can see over here this is the image that we got pretty amazing and yes pretty detailed image as well yes if you want to save this image as well just click on to and just save this image that's all you can do and it will save this image okay so that's how you can save this image as well 
so that's the two link that i wanted to show you because lots of the people were asking me about how to load this model control net extension on like google collab so the first link that i showed you was like control net collab fp16 model with automatic 1111 gui this was the first link and this was the second link as i've already showed you as i've already showed you that there are so many models on this link and yes this is not automatic 1111 gui so that's the two link and yes you can go and run with like any of the model here as well so guys that's the thing that i wanted to show you how to run control net extension on google collab that's the two thing that i wanted to show you and yes you can go and enjoy this control net extension on google collab as well and yes i will be back with more and more videos tomorrow till then have a good day bye guys love you all guys bye guys